Hi loves, welcome back to my channel. I'm actually wearing makeup today. I haven't worn makeup in like three weeks. Like since I got, you know, sick and everything. And yeah, I just like, I don't wanna wear makeup. But today I was like, okay, maybe I should look semi good for the vlog for once. <laughs> so here we are, we have just my natural everyday makeup. Anyways. Today is a day we are going to start my office makeover. I already like took some stuff out over there just to get it out of the way um, because I need to figure out like where it's going to go because those are the agenda covers that are on sale on the shop. There's only a few left so if you want to get them, get them now because I was doing inventory yesterday and I was like that's it. That's all I have. So yeah, I put it in our linen closet because there's room there. So that's where they're at right now, um, in the bin. Um, anyways, I'm excited. I have everything. Let me show you. <clears throat> we got lights um, and how we're going to maneuver that. We have, I bought this. It's supposed to be for like lights, but I'm going to use it to organize my cords in the back of, you know, my desk and everything. And then... Um, I can't show you right now, but I also have floating shelves. So this big shelf up above with the ugly, ugly brackets are finally going to go. Um, yeah, I, I kept it because I needed the storage and I needed something that can hold a lot of weight, you know. And now that I have somewhere else to put my agenda covers and stuff and I don't have a whole lot anymore um, I don't need the shelf um, I'm gonna have to figure out where I'm gonna put all of this because I do have I don't even know where I'm pointing um, some packaging packaging things for the shop I'll figure it out I have to declutter anyways like my drawers and everything so it's gonna be a whole process but for right now I'm gonna go ahead and take all of this apart and yeah, get that going. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, the shelf is gone. Now I'm gonna see how easy it is to peel this stuff off. Oh! <laughs> wow, this is so satisfying. Oh boy, it is like way later. Um, earlier I stopped, I ate lunch, picked up Liam, and then a little bit later I have this huge migraine and then I look outside and it's like super sunny. Like the weather just went from rainy, cold and gloomy to summer. It went from, I think it was like 65 to now it's around 75. And my head is just pounding. So since 1 o'clock, I've been just like laying in bed. And it sucks because I can't even do anything. <laughs> like I did emails and was on my phone for a bit. But then I was like, oh, I can't stare at a screen any longer. So I tried to nap. Didn't really work. I just kind of laid there while Liam jumped around me. So anyways, I wanted to show you guys something that's going in my office. Um, we went to the thrift store last weekend and I found, you guys know I love Chinoseri vases and just like anything really, like anything white and blue to be honest. They're kind of all over the house. Um, I'm sure if you've seen like any type of house videos of mine or something like that um but anyways i found some on sunday and i just well i didn't just clean it i cleaned it earlier today so let me just show you don't mind the mess over here but this look at this beautiful set um it doesn't have any white or anything like that but i thought it was still really really pretty and it goes with kind of like what I'm going for um, in my office. So yeah, they're all clean and they're just super cute. And yeah, it was a set of three for only $16, you guys. Like $16. You will find something like this at Home Goods, like this size, for like 30, you know? So I was like, this is a good deal. I'm gonna get it and I love it. And they're all pretty lightweight. I mean, they're just cera like ceramic. Um, so they're gonna go on the shelves in my office, um, but so pretty. They are, all of them say hand-painted, made in Japan. So yeah, that's what it says in the bottom of all of them. I mean, I don't think they're all exactly the same, um, but they all have like a cereal, kind of like that. So I think it's such a good find and it's so pretty and I love that it has that gold accent on them so it matches um, the gold accents in my office. So I'm really excited to have found this. It's going to go great on the floating shelves that we're going to add into my office area. Yay! I'm excited. What is it? A butterfly. A butterfly. Tom brought home. Food. 
Oh. What is this? This is it? And you didn't buy any chicken? What happened? This is Dan's Kitchen. The other Chinese place is closed today on family vacation. Oh. So I had to go back to Dan's Kitchen and order this. Okay. Look what Tom got. It looks like cow pot. Is it? I got the... It's like fried rice. Beef fried rice. These are yummy. Yum. Look at that. You can't even see the holes on camera anymore. Tom's filling them all in. There's so many holes like right there. I'm done sitting, so you're putting it back. You're so funny. Look at my room. It's so messy. <laughs> Those are the new shelves out there. Okay, that's it, baby. It doesn't go any further. You're so cute. You're so cute. <laughs> no, no, no. No, no. Look at daddy working.
guys, here is a look at my office area with the wallpaper. It's all done. It makes me so happy. I do have the shelving units there right now just to see like where things are going to go. I don't know if you can see, but I have like little tapes in certain areas just so I can see like this is the height of things and this is where the shelves are going to go and stuff like that. So yeah, trying to measure it all out and then trying to see like where I want these positioned because it kind of really doesn't matter um, where I put them. I might scoot this one over that way more. That one obviously that way more. Um, but yeah, I do have a tabletop to go on top of this that is a lot um, deeper than the one that I have because the one that I already had was just like 16 inches and honestly, it's not enough room. So the one that I have, I think right now is 23 something inches the perfect depth for the table and then it's gonna go like straight to the wall that way and then this right here is uh let me just uh, so this right here is gonna go in that corner and it's actually taller than that so the table is gonna go right up against it um tom's gonna have to cut it out but yeah we're making progress. I'm very, very happy with the wallpaper. Um, it was really difficult actually to apply this one. Um, it doesn't align like my last one. Uh, so even if you have it like edge to edge, it's, it doesn't align for some reason. Um, also, I did overlap it a little bit. One thing I learned from wallpapering my last one is that even if you do align it edge to edge, over time the wallpaper itself actually shifts so I didn't show you guys I don't think I don't think I have any footage of it or anything like that but the wallpaper my last one actually shifted and there were gaps in between so where the edges were it was really bad um, so what I did with this one is I overlapped it a little bit um, enough to like if there were to shift um, there would be like something underneath it still or whatever so yeah I just went ahead and overlapped it and you can't really tell where it is which I love so yeah very happy with how this wallpaper turned out all right it is another day it's actually Saturday and this is what my office is looking like um, we didn't do anything on Thursday because we lost power if you watch my other vlog, you would have seen me talk about it when we lost power. But yesterday, um, we did put the new tabletop on. So Tom was able to cut it to size. I wanted it to stick out as much as possible just because that is what this whole thing was about. Um, the last dust that I had only came out to here which is 16 inches in depth and honestly as you can see that's just like my monitor and then I usually have my keyboard right here and then I won't have any other room so anyways this one sticks out to about 24 inches so it is just like you can see here you have to cut that off to have it like that um, which to me that's fine I never to be honest with you I never really close this um, the curtains maybe one time whenever you know we had guests sleeping in this room because this is obviously a guest bedroom <laughs> um, but anyways yeah I never really close it um, but anyways this is what it's looking like so far I'm so excited um, now next thing we're gonna do are the floating shelves and 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 my lights came in so i had ordered just normal gold ones and i wasn't super happy with it because it was just so plain i'll pop a photo right here so you can see it's just so 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 plain so anyways i actually saw this while i was looking for you know the lights to begin with but I couldn't find a seller that, uh, what's it called, would deliver soon. Um, I think the soonest one that I saw was um, August for estimated arrival. And I was like, I can't wait that long. But anyways, I found a seller 
the other day like I think it was Wednesday I ordered this because I was like oh my gosh and just look at it so it has gold hardware and you can see it has this beautiful glass porcelain let me just try and be careful here because yeah here we go look at this look how pretty so it's gonna stick out like that it's so cute you guys like i am so excited um so yeah i got two obviously and i'm just so so much more happier with this than the other one i'm, I'm excited um i also have this frame i got this last year at at home and i never put it up in our bathroom just because I realize our bathroom has more so of a chrome metal like everywhere and this has gold so it's gonna go in my room I'm actually gonna flip I'm gonna put it right here above the bed so this is gonna flip this way and then the frame um, yeah we'll see how that goes but it is the same size like that and the frame is the same size so that's great um, but yeah I have my coffee here because I'm about to do some work. I need to catch up on one of my Instagram account, my journal account, um, and then I have to do some journaling. Also, I have to start orders. I have a few to ship out on Monday and Tuesday, so that's what I'm doing. I'm going to have to clean this area out. Oh, I purchased this at Target on Thursday. It's Nesco because I needed another one, right? But I couldn't pass her up. I love Nesco. She's my favorite on Demon Slayer and it was only $14.99. So, not bad. Super cute. Oh, by the way, I don't know if I'm going to be putting all of my anime figures here. Like my acrylic shelves. I'm thinking I might put it on the sides over there, but I haven't completely decided yet. So I'm going to wait to do all of that. Um, you know, I want to finish this area first and then we'll do anime stuff. Um, I was thinking this Totoro shelf, I was going to put it like right there and then I can put my acrylic shelves there. Like I can do three little rows. Um, so that's another idea. So I can have all my anime over there. We'll see. Um, but look, look what Liam did. He put his little figures there. They're like from McDonald's, the robot ones. He's so funny. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna start working now. <laughs> What's that? Coins. Coins? That's all the money you have? Yeah. That's it? Yeah. <laughs> wow. You're so rich, you can buy so many toys with that. <laughs> One toy? Yeah. Oh. You just wanna buy a Bakugan with that? Oh. Just one baku gun. Yeah. Sounds good. <clears throat> On your birthday, you can buy a baku gun. Yeah. <laughs> okay, here are the shelves. Tom just finished putting them up. So the top one is a 42 and 1 8 I believe. And then the other one is like a 35. And I will link them below. They're from Menards, but they're just plain white floating shelves. And we have it centered to the closet. So yeah, instead of like centering it to the table, like the actual desk, I just prefer center to the actual closet because we are adding lights and I want those to be totally um, centered, you know what I mean? So yeah, that is what we did today or Tom did today because I definitely wouldn't have been able to do that. He did a lot of measuring to make sure it's centered and you know, you have to have it leveled and everything like that. And I definitely didn't want to do it because I didn't want to screw up the wallpaper, but he did it, so, so thankful. Um, I don't think we're not doing the lights today. We're going to probably do it tomorrow or the next day. We'll see. But I'm going to go and set up 
my desk a little bit. I, I can plug in my iMac, I think, now. Um, and maybe put stuff on the shelves. We'll see. shelves looks like I kind of played with it all day today and here is what's staying <laughs> I switched out a lot of things and really wanted to keep it simple also I'm scared that these shelves um, you know they'll give in if I put too much weed on it so I tried really hard to just kind of like select items that don't have too much weight on them so yeah, there you have it. I love it. I think it looks so good. It's a lot of my old stuff. The only thing that's new is the hourglass and then the feather and the candle. This pink one. Where's my finger? That one. Those are from the dollar store, to be honest. And then this frame um, is from Target. But everything else I've already had. So that's awesome. Liam's here, you guys. <laughs> so anyways, I wanted to show you the lights. Tom just finished putting them up. Oh my goodness. How freaking cute are they? They are so perfect. I am so much happier with these. Oh my goodness. It's just so cute. Elegant, girly, everything. I love it. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. So Tom's actually downstairs. Um, cutting like little pipe pieces to hold my lights because these are not in there electrically you know like there's no switch or anything like that and yeah I guess you don't want to do all that and have them do electrical stuff so anyways we're doing it's like called a puck light thing so there's like a little thing that goes on here that screws in there and then this is my lights um, yeah, I'll show you guys how we do it, but... Ooh. Oh my goodness, look at your tan line. Okay. <laughs> look at his hand, his arm. <laughs> You're so cute. Oh, no. On. Yeah. Oh, you're funny. Me, me. Oh my god, so cute. Me, me, me. There's the little pipe piece. What is what was that called? Like a pipe? It's a fitting. To a go fitting. Go from, yeah, I don't know. I think it's a inch to three, three quarter. Yeah. Or something. So Tom just used. We didn't even use um, super glue. I was thinking super glue, but he has this tape. Oh gosh, sticky. Oh no, it's stuck to me. <gasps> it's like double sided tape. So yeah, these are just like battery operated ones. I will link them on Amazon, but. Like I said, there's no like electrical in there, so this is like one of those puck light tricks or something that I saw online. I was just on Pinterest and searching it, and yeah, I found this little trick. So this is from Amazon. It was like a dollar. You can get it at Lowe's and stuff, I think. And then those two lights, it's a pack of two and then it comes with this. Um, no batteries, obviously. I think it was like 17. I don't know. But that was the one that like a lot of people use for this little trick. So that's why I bought it. Um, I mean, I'm sure there's other ones too, but yeah. Sticking it on in the middle, I hope. And then you just screw it in whatever light fixture you have and you're good to go. Oh yes. 
See? So instead of a light bulb sticking out, because that's what that thing looks like, um, I'll link the lamp below, but like usually like a light bulb sticks out, but look at this annoying boy. Ta-da! Liam, look at the lights! It looks so pretty! Oh wow! It matches everything! I'm so happy with this makeover. Oh my gosh, I'm so so happy. Banana. <laughs> so yeah, the lights, let's see. Off. On. Oh! They both turn on at the same time. Oh I love. And this is let's see, what's that? Ooh, 50%? hundred percent? Oh, and there's even timers to how you want to leave them on for a long time. That's nice and watch. Look. Oh, no. It didn't turn off at the same time. Oh. It did earlier. That was pretty cool. Oh, no. Maybe. Oh, there we go. It did it. <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> Look at that. Thanks, Dad. It looks so good. Oh my god, I love it. This is so much better than what I had before. It looks so good and clean, little boy. Oh, and then we got one of these things I didn't show you guys. It's like a corner squishy... It's just go. a stick on, right? Yeah. Yeah, you just stick it on there and you're good to go. So you don't have like a rough edge, you know, because it sticks out pretty far. But yeah, so that's nice. I like that it's clear too, so it's not ugly. But yeek. So that wraps up this video, you guys. That is my office makeover. Oh my goodness. I am so happy with this entire space it matches the rest of my room it's so much brighter it's just more me and then it's just i love it so much all the little touches of gold it's like a whole new me but also me if that makes sense it really makes me so happy also all the space on my desk i am so excited to journal here every single day there's actually room now you guys I'm so excited. So that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and seeing the process of this makeover. If you have any questions, feel free to leave me a comment down below. I will try and list and link everything that I shared with you. And yeah, thank you guys for watching and until next time, bye.